Wait, uh, an hour? Motion tracking, the process of recording footage and then replicating the camera's motion digitally. And the first step of this is obviously recording your footage. So take a video of whatever you want. Just try to limit motion blur as much as possible. Now in Blender, go in and open up a new motion tracking workspace so we can load in our footage and begin tracking. Just don't forget to set your view transform back to standard and match the frame rate to that of your footage. Do these two things and you're good to go. Okay, so future editing Benji here. Remember to set your frames and prefetch your data because Pro, it'll save you like so much time later on. Alright, back to the to the video. So you can go control clicking to manually find different points to track, or have Blender do this for you. Now select everything with A and go ahead and track it forward. Now immediately some of these will be kind of bad, so you can manually delete them out. Once again, just make Blender do it. Either way, go ahead and solve your camera motion and check the pixel error. You'll want a value less than one, so repeat this process until you get a good looking pixel error. Now hit these two buttons, align your camera, and you're good to go.